How's Tutorial for Beginners. Hi guys, this is Speak About Digital, and welcome to this video tutorial on how to use Howes, the all-in-one business software for contractors and design pros. Howes is an online platform that lets you attract and win better clients, run profitable projects, and deliver a standout customer experience all in one place. In this tutorial, we will guide you step-by-step -step through the key aspects of using Howes effectively, from setting up your account to exploring the vast array of resources at your disposal. We will also show you how to create a new lead and how to add a new client. We have a lot to cover in this video, so let's get started with the tutorial. To begin using Howes, the first step is to create an account. You will find the link down below in the description, so go to the description of this video and click on the first link you find there. This will take you to the correct home page. Once you're on the home page, enter your email address and then click on the Join for Free button located next to the email field. Upon clicking, you'll be redirected to another page where you can create your account. Start by choosing a strong password, then select a professional category that best fits your business. Additionally, provide your business name, phone number, first name, and last name. Once all the necessary information is filled out, click on the Create Free Account button to proceed. The next step will prompt you to provide your business address. Input your business address, city, zip code, and business website address as required. After completing this step, click on the Next button to proceed further. Once you've completed the basic account setup, you may be asked to provide more details by following the on-screen prompts. If you prefer not to provide any additional information at this point, you can choose to click on the Skip option in each window. After completing the sign-up process, you'll be directed to your account dashboard. From here, you can explore and utilize the various features and tools that House offers to promote and manage your business effectively. Once you access the dashboard, you will land on the home page. On the home page, you will see a setup guide to assist you in configuring your account. This home page also provides an overview of various sections such as leads, mood boards, idea books, to-do lists, and support resources, giving you a comprehensive view of your activities and options. At the top of the home page, a user-friendly top menu is displayed. This menu comprises different tabs, each serving a specific function. The Leads tab allows you to view and manage your leads, giving you access to both new and existing ones. Additionally, you have the option to create a new lead by simply clicking on the Create New Lead button. Under the Manage tab, you can explore a range of management options for different aspects of your business. This includes handling people, such as clients, managing assets like mood boards, and keeping track of essential business elements like purchase orders. The Marketing section provides access to various marketing tools. Here you can access your House profile and website, as well as gain insights into the effectiveness of your House advertising efforts. The House tab is a gateway to the diverse features and offerings of House. You can browse through House photos, shop for products, explore House magazine, participate in House discussions, watch House TV, and access your idea books from this section. For any assistance or support, the Help tab is available, offering access to the Help Center video tutorials, webinars, and additional learning resources to ensure you can make the most of House's platform. Moreover, the top menu also provides quick access options such as search, notifications, messages, and account, allowing for easy navigation and efficient management of your house account. With these tools at your disposal, you can effectively leverage House's platform to enhance your business and creative endeavors. Now, let's see how to create a new lead in House. Before moving on to the process of creating a new lead in House, we would like to explain why we create leads in House. We create leads in House to find and manage potential customers, build relationships, and streamline our workflow, ultimately growing our business and promoting our services to millions of homeowners on the platform. Creating a new lead in House is a straightforward process that can be completed in just a few simple steps. To begin, navigate to the top menu and click on the Leads tab. A drop-down menu will appear, and from there, select the Create New Lead option. This action will take you to a page where you can view your existing leads, including those that are active, new, and followed up, among others. On this page, click on Add Leads, and you'll be presented with three options, Create New Lead, Import from File, and Import from Email. To create a new lead, choose the first option, Create New Lead. A pop-up window will appear, prompting you to enter the client's name in the Client field. If you wish to include more client details, click on the More Client Details option. 
Here you can add the client's email address, street address, state, primary phone number, city, and zip code for further organization. Next, provide the lead details by entering the lead name in the designated field. Similarly, if you want to include information about the lead, click on More Lead Details. Now you can input details such as lead source, estimated revenue, estimated budget, description, expected start date, estimated profit, and project type to better manage the lead. Additionally, you can assign lead owners to this new lead. Click on the field below Lead Owners and select the appropriate owner from the list. Once all the necessary information has been provided, click on the Create Lead button to finalize the process. Your new lead will now be created and you will be directed to a page where you can view and manage details related to the lead. From here, you can also create a mood board, add notes, keep a call log, and send messages relevant to the specific lead. With these features at your disposal, managing and nurturing leads becomes an efficient and organized process within the House platform. Next, let's see how to add a new client in House Pro. To add a new client in House Pro, navigate to the top menu and click on the Manage tab. Once you click, a list of options will appear, and among them, select Clients. This action will take you to a page where you can effectively manage all your clients. If you already have created clients, you will see them listed here. However, if you haven't added any clients yet, the page will be empty. To add a new client, click on the Add New Client button and a pop-up window will appear, allowing you to enter the client's contact details. Start by providing the client's full name, email address, phone number, and company name. If you need to include additional email addresses for the client, simply click on the Add Another Email Address option. Similarly, if the client has multiple phone numbers, click on Add Another Phone Number to input the relevant information. Next, proceed to add the client's address details, including the address, city, state, and zip code. In the Internal Notes section, you have the option to include private notes related to the client. These notes serve as a valuable resource for keeping track of important details or interactions specific to the client. Once all the necessary information has been entered, click on the Save button to add the client to your House Pro account. After successfully saving the client's details, the client will be officially added to your list and you can now manage their information and track interactions effectively within the and there you have it, a beginner's guide to using House, the all-in-one business software for contractors and design pros. If you want to try it out for yourself, you can sign up using the first link in the description. I would really appreciate that. Thank you. I hope you found it useful and learned something new. So again, if you found this video helpful, please give me a thumbs up. And if you have any questions at all, please comment below. I try to answer all the comments the best I can. Thanks for watching and take care.